about the DC. I want to talk about a subject that comes to mind, and that is will Diana switch sides for Tariq? Now, I spoke about this in the past. I spoke about the fact that Diana might be the one who switches and joins sides with Tariq. And the reason why I'm saying that is because at the end of the day, there's still some love for Tariq, some sort of intimacy for Tariq coming from her. And let me tell you something. I, I, I've said this before, and I'm going to say it again. I've seen some women put some men through some stuff, and, and they still still will come back to the guy and still love him and, and love him more because of the stuff that has happened and i know you're thinking to yourselves hey um wasn't she trying to get him to be taken out or pretty much be put down because they were saying that he was trying to betray um noma and he and he actually tried to take out monet yeah but at the end of the day, you got to remember that Drew was the lead behind that whole thing. Drew was the main guy behind it all. Diana just worked with Drew and Diana played a part in some things. But it was Drew who was the mastermind because he made it up in his mind. He was done with Monet. He wanted her out of the way. And not only that, he wanted anybody out of the way that would be in his way. And he thinks he's got Kane under control. He thinks he has Diana under control. And so Drew has a lot more motives but when it comes down to diana will diana switch sides and will her feelings win and will she try to get with Tariq and him aside with Tariq and him and betray her family no one everybody to be with Tariq and protect him do you see that coming hard to say right now the way things ended in power book two season three the only woman who seemed like they ever really truly loved Tariq was lauren and so when it comes down to it you're thinking to yourself all that time that that he's given to diana all that love he's given to diana they're off and on there you know it was like the moment he met diana diana immediately liked him and that has to count for something and the same thing could be said about effie as well because Tariq and effie have history it's just effie had a history of already betraying Tariq prior and him being being very careful with her with her promising she would never betray him again only for her to do it again and put him in a situation where he daggone could have been dead so when it comes down to it Diana however effectively try to set Tariq up effectively try to set Tommy up effectively try to take Monet out playing a hand and things so she has some guilt she has some blood on her hands in this situation but would she switch sides now the thing is with diana diana has been known to be the switcher she has switched on Tariq more than once in sort of a hidden way uh twice Tariq has left his room or left his bedroom for her to sneak into his stuff and get information now she tried to do this in season one but Tariq caught her and caught on to her immediately whereas I guess now he he just looks at her like he can kind of trust her and that's why she did what she did in season two or season three pretty much sneaking behind his back and doing stuff but at the same time she's the type that will switch on anybody she has switched on Monet before she has switched on Kane before her and Drew has never gotten to a point where they are, they're going to have to switch on one another but I think we're probably coming up on that moment now she has switched on Kane and defended Tariq um, against Kane before so Diana's loyalties is really with no one and really I think her loyalties is dominantly to herself and not only herself but what she truly wants when it comes down to it but would she switch sides um, for Tariq would she come back to Tariq would she turn on Drew and want to stay out of the, the whole beef um, that's going on with Tariq and Noma and everybody um, for Tariq Tariq. It's hard to say because at the end of the day, when it comes down to it, a person like Diana doing the things she she does and doing the things she has done, you really can never put a person like that in your book no more. Like that's somebody who you can most definitely be like, yo, I, I can't see myself, um, you know, doing anything with her no more. I mean, she done put me put my life on the line, bro. Like I ain't even feeling that. But at the end of the day, there's a chance that Diana might switch sides. And we're just going to have to wait and see how that one plays out. But basically, when it comes down to it, I just want to know what you guys are thinking. Do you think that Diana will switch sides and join back with Tariq? Do you think that she will still be with Drew trying to do some stuff? Do you think she will try to protect Kane or Monet from Drew? Do you think that she would want to be in the power position against uh, Tariq? We'll have to see. All I know is that basically when it comes down to it, it's your boy Bobby B. here. Just want to say much love, much respect. Hold it down. And hold on.